Hey everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV where today we're continuing the main story. As we're getting started today, I do want to note that I have moved recently, so if things are sounding different, apologies, I'm working my best to get everything back to how it was before, but I have moved, which is very exciting. I'm also very excited to give a, uh, get back to recording this because it's been about a week and a half and I've been missing it. So, what, what did we do last time in the main story? Right, we found evidence that w there may be heretics in members of, uh, among the th uh, four high houses of Ishgard. And Ishgard takes that very seriously. So, let's see what we can do to help. Sir Carillo has something very important to tell you. Come closer, lass, and listen well. This is for your ears only. Lord Francil is no heretic. He is a goodly righteous man who wholly dedicated to the cause. I know this because I served House Hilinar for years prior to the Calamity. You must go to Skyfire Locks and warn, warn him of the coming storm. The Inquisitors are ruthless and will spare him no mercy. Speak to him of an Edelweiss and he will know you are for a friend. Now go. Okay then. Let's go warn Lord Francel, I suppose. Hoping that we're not getting played. Not really a fan of getting caught up in Ishgardian politics when we don't really know much about them, but, well, we do need their help. In order to stop Garuda, which seems to be a very pressing threat, so... Eh. Alright then, Lord Francel, we are going to be heading up this way, a little ways up the Skyfire Locks. Veering off to the west, and looks like in this building up here... All right, where are you, Lord Francel? There you are. Yes, you look as though you have something to say, do you? Uh, is that an Edelweiss in your pocket? Are you just, oh really, you're gonna make me say that? I see Sir Carlo has not forgotten my mother's favorite flower. A pity it has not been seen in Kirtha since the calamity. You may speak freely here, friend. That's... that's absurd! I would sooner die than become a thrall of the dragons! Alas, it matters little what I say at this point. Although the Draconian Rosary was not found in my possession, it will still be considered by many to be proof of my heresy. I must do my utmost to prove my innocence to the Inquisitors, for if they harbor even the slightest doubt... Ah, <sighs> this will only add weight to the incessant accusations our house has suffered of late. It's as though the gods themselves are plotting our fall. You risk much by coming here. It is only proper that I recompense you for this deed. Tell me what you desire and I shall do my best to provide. A missing airship? I see. It may require a prolonged effort to locate your quarry. I shall direct you to one in a better position to assist you. Lord Harshavant of House Fortum uh, commands the garrison at Camp Dragonhead. Present to him this letter of introduction and he will surely be receptive to your needs. Alright, introducing ourselves to the house is ourself. Thank you so much, Francel. I really hope the best for you. I hope that everything turns out for the best and no one is falsely imprisoned or whatever they do to heretics. All right, then up to meet with Harshafont. And that's going to take us the rest of the way up to Camp Dragonhead where we can get a new porter as well as uh, Etherite. It'll be nice to set our home point somewhere new so we don't have to walk in from Falgord Float. Alright, we'll start with the porter. Well met, Traveler. Might I interest you in a Chocobo Porter? Ah, do not tell me. This is your first visit to this stop. Yes, it is indeed. Thank you so much for getting me registered, so now we can... Well, hello, Sid and Alphano. How are you two doing? I'm glad we left the observatorium. The people there were not friendly. Though even here I can feel eyes upon us. We... we are not safe. Were you in the observatorium and I just didn't notice you? I'm so sorry. We came here to find an airship, yet now we meddle in Ishgardian affairs of state? God, if Alize were here, I would never hear the end of it. Yeah, I'm I'm kind of feeling I'm kind of feeling not so great about this either. I assume Alize would be your sister then, who we saw back at the uh, back of the memorials before we became a member of the 
one of the grand companies. Alright, Etherite attuned. I'm realizing I forgot to set my home point, so let's go fix that. There we are, new home point set. And let's head on in to meet with Harshafont. Hello, sorry for jumping over your table. I'm just now realizing that's probably rude. Ah, the unmistakable swagger of a well-traveled adventure. If you are come to pay your respects, be at ease, friend. I am not one to stand on formality. Truth be told, I would gladly welcome many and more brave souls like yourself. But enough chatter. Pray tell me why you have come. If there's any justice in this world, these charges will receive no serious consideration. It is beyond inconceivable. Ah yes, the letter made mention of a pressing matter for, you, uh, for which you required assistance. What might that be? So this enterprise you speak of was last seen above Kirthus before the Calamity five years ago. I fear it may prove difficult to find any eyewitnesses to these events, for while Ishgard did not participate in the Battle of Cartano, we were embroiled in our own internal conflicts at the time. Nevertheless, I will make inquiries on your behalf and share with you my findings in the future. In the meantime, please enjoy the hospitality of Camp Dragonhead. I will see that you are afforded every courtesy as a guest of House Fortom. Wow, you are exceedingly generous! Just like that, we are on our way to getting the exact info we need. I'm going to just go ahead and take the money because I'm pretty sure we're going to be building our own armor pretty soon. And with that, we're now free to explore Camp Dragonhead as we please. That's not that we weren't before, but now we can just kind of chill around here and do what we want. Nothing new from you. Nothing new from you. So then, next time on Final Fantasy XIV... Uh, I believe it's time to head back to Limzolo Minsa so we can do some armoring. Time to make ourselves some nice new metal armor. I'll see everyone next time for that. <laughs>